la cooperación de múltiples áreas para el ámbito educativo es fundamental en tanto estemos claros que son la propuesta para fomentar y potenciar las destrezas y competencias del siglo XXI y exponer a nuestros niños y jóvenes a escenarios reales. Esta activación del trabajo multidisciplinario, escuela y empresa hace evidente el esfuerzo como sociedad por preparar a nuestros estudiantes a vivir en un mejor presente y diseñar junto a ellos un futuro funcional y equitativo. The COVID-19 pandemic has had a major impact on ministries of education throughout the entire region. As we seek to reopen schools, it's important that we weigh the risk and benefits to our children's education, the public health and socioeconomic impact. In order to do this, we need to have a whole of society and intersectoral approach. The health sector for health and safety, mental health support, and to maintain our immunization programs. It is vital that we harmonize our responses to help keep SDG 4 on track so that we don't lose the hard-won gains that we have made so far for SDG 4 in the Caribbean. The CARICOM Secretariat, through its coordination of multilateral and multi-sector partnerships, has served to protect the continued advancement of progress made against the E2030 Agenda and the CARICOM HRD 2030 strategy. Advocating for increased teacher training to support quality online, blended and remote pedagogies. Es hora de seguir trabajando, de reimaginar y reconstruir la educación y de que el acceso al agua o a la conectividad deje de ser el privilegio de unos pocos y sea el derecho de todos. Or why we should listen to youth participation in education 2030 is because the youths are the ones who will be partic not only participating in this, but are the ones who will be carrying education 2030 to a higher height. Este es un momento histórico en que tenemos una oportunidad como pocas veces vista. Y esa oportunidad se puede resumir en la noción, en la idea que la evaluación como motor y como impulso del aprendizaje tiene una fuerza como pocas otras acciones pedagógicas tienen en el contexto educativo. The COVID-19 pandemic has certainly taught us that people are at the center of all that we do. And what people do, feel, think and value will determine our collective ability to address our real problems. Most importantly, educators must strive to make schools places of belonging for all stakeholders. As we continue to face COVID-19 pandemic, the concept of leave no one behind must be translated into concrete actions by all governments. As a region, we must prioritize and fast track actions for the poorest and most marginalized. The goal of inclusive and equitable quality education is to create opportunities for all. And so, what this initiative has done is to highlight many opportunities for skill development and to send a powerful message, particularly to young people, about the power of technical and vocational education and training to transform their lives and to create a brighter future for all of us. Tenemos que juntar fuerzas con gobiernos, las organizaciones de sociedad civil, las agencias para poder garantizar que las niñas tengan las condiciones y puedan regresar a la escuela y seguir con su futuro.